All right, welcome back, good people. Um, let's go ahead and pick up where we left off. So while we're here, we are going to turn in the mushroom quest, which is just right here. Then we'll go check out the ponyta. A nice springy mushroom. He's going to teach the recipe for mushroom cakes, I believe. Ah yes, Cakeler Base. Yep, so we got the recipe for mushroom cakes. Awesome. I don't know if I'll ever use it. Honestly. Um, yep, so a lot of these are in the Crimson Mirelands now. Um, there aren't any new requests, it looks like. So let's just go to the Horseshoe Plains. Check out that peculiar um, ponyta. And we'll also um, we'll also look for some weasels too while we're out here. Let's see if we can get that other quest done as well. Normally there's Yep, there's one. Since it's on the way. Okay. Any other weasels? Oh, a couple over there. Let's get this first. Resting. So, higher chance of catching. Oh, that one was a large specimen. So, that's a good sign for the uh, quest. Hopefully, it's big enough. <laughs> it's always the goal big enough for the quest. Come on. There we go. Oh, well. That's all right. All right, here we are. Peculiar Ponyta. I really do like the shiny for Ponyta, to be fair. I think it's kind of interesting that they, they give you a shiny, like, right off the bat. Oh, is that another Eevee I see? Priorities, you know. Gotta grab the Eevee first. Oh no. Well, it saw me. That's okay. There will be plenty more where that came from. Oh, it's bright green. They really just want you to grab it. Oh. It really just uh, canceled my throw, didn't it? Got some stardust from that tumble stone. Always for stardust. Alright, is there anything else? So we got those two. I kind of want to go get the weasel first, honestly. Um, yeah, let's just go. Let's head back real quick. Head back to town. And there's the shiny ponyta. A little bit of money. All right. Well, let's go back to the village. Turn in those two quests, and then we'll head to the Mirelands to continue the story. 
Where's it at? All the way over there. Let's just go over this way. So if I remember correctly, it was 228. So let's take a look at the, this one we caught. Size, where's the size? 26, oop, that's not big enough. Two foot. Oh no. Yeah, these are all older if I remember correctly. One of these new? Because two six is not big enough. Oh no. Here I was thinking we had finally caught one big enough. And it seems I was wrong. <laughs> so, not enough. Wow, I do not remember having that much trouble. Okay, that noise was very discouraging. I don't remember having that much trouble. Um, the last time, my last file that I was playing. So that's a little discouraging. Especially since they're considered large specimens, but just not large enough. Yep, different colored Pokemon. That's part of the fun. <laughs> trying to think if there's anything else we need to check out here. But I don't believe there is. So I think we can just head on out. Ah uh, yes, mass outbreaks. That's Cricketot. I'm not gonna worry about that though. Let's just continue with the mission. And we can check out some other requests too. Ah, the music's great. Here we are, my girl, the Crimson Mirelands, an area teeming with poison-wielding Pokemon and plenty of others besides. Seems like you're in for a tough mission. I'm sure you can handle it, though. Oh, that's right, you're heading to the Salacion Ruins, aren't you? They're off that way if you need a pointer. See the entrance way over there? That's not very far. <laughs> You know, I wish we could tell where or when one of those space-time distortions was going to erupt. I wonder if checking your map would help. Mm-hmm. I'm counting on both of you to carry out your survey work as best you can. But be mindful of your limitations as well, won't you? If wild Pokemon are giving you trouble, I suggest you go to the training grounds and have Captain Zizu teach your Pokemon some strong moves. That actually might be a good idea, even just to get some variety of moves. Um, a variety of type of moves, at least, is what I mean to say. I'm trying to save my apricorns for, like, great balls and other such things. Ah, yes, more requests <laughs> from Bera. The go-getter. Yep, I'm a go-getter. Rosalia. Roselia, I guess. Complete uh, Rosalia's page. Let's see. Should we go pick up those requests? 
Wind swept run at night. Hardy grains will get just naturally. Find the Pokemon with three leaves. Um, Oddish, I assume. I'm honestly trying to remember. Honestly, none of these are super important. Um, let's go grab this one at least. Hey, look right there. Hardy grains. Oh yes. Stay away from the alphas. Um, let's go ahead and catch this one, this Burmy. gonna grab some of these Pokemon as we go, but I'm not gonna make too big a deal out of it. It's not an alpha, we can maybe try and catch it. One. If it doesn't work out, then it doesn't work out. Oh! I am not hidden here. <laughs> There we go. Hey, nice. I guess it's nighttime. Can I even get over there? I might not be able to get over there yet. Ooh. Come on, we're deer strats. Skyrim strats. Nice. <laughs> Easy. Second, please. Let's see. Let's get Ponyta out, I guess. For super effective. Level 18, we're fine. I honestly wasn't sure what level of uh, Pokemon this would be. Well, that's too bad. Good enough. Well, let's go ahead and hit this tree. See what it is. Another Burmy. Let's just go ahead and kill this one. Ah, too bad. Ouch. Not, not too big in the pouch, actually. We're fine. <laughs> ah, here we are. Plan. So let's go ahead. Oh, that's right. We kind of have to do that manually. Erase that. 
Let's pick up this quest from the Diamond Clan. Marsha. A medicine. For the for the Psydex. Alright. Um, well, let's go to the cave. Wow. Come on, Dewalt. Let's see. Defeat with grass type moves. I don't think I have any grass type moves. Is it? There's some just defeated. I mean, we'll need to catch. Catch some as well. Ooh, this is a strong one. Um, let's go ahead and agile style. Maybe if we do it again. Oh, just a normal one. Will give us a second. Attack. Oh, good enough for me. And let's just tackle. Tackle, but finish it off. All right. Was a back attack. Back attack. <laughs> you know what I mean. No, you don't see me. You don't see me. That one was a heavy specimen as well. Oh. Back attack. Nice. Okay. Let's keep going now. Yes, hello, hello. Where am I even going? Wait a second. Where's the, um... Oop. There it is. Yeah, I've gotta drop down. Ooh. But before I drop down, let's get some sky tumblestone. For those feather balls. Let's see if. Ooh, no. Ouch. Alright, there's cricketots over here. It's all well and good, but let's go in here. We'll talk to the warden, and then we'll be done for this video. I'm Kalaba of the Pearl Clan, Warden Kalaba to you. Oh, now would you look at that? You have a Celestica flute. You must be the one they say fell out of the space-time rift. That's right. I see, I see. I've already heard about you, that you quelled Cleavor in his frenzy. I'm sure many people were saved by your actions, but I wonder if there wasn't some other way to handle the situation. What you did is hardly different from bullying a Pokemon into submission, after all. And you run about catching Pokemon up in those little balls you carry. I don't need any help from your sort, or the Diamond Clan, for that matter. That young lady, Arazu, offered to help, but associating with the Diamond Clan, it just won't do. Be on your way. There is much I must do, and I prefer not to be distracted any further. Ah, oh, Kraken, how about you show me the strength that could quell even a frenzied lord? Sure. A battle with you might let me experience even a fraction of the power the nobles wield. Well, I guess we're going to do this battle and then we'll be done. <laughs> Toe 
Okay. All right. Um, let's just do a normal swift. All right, takes half. Should be. Oh. Looks like I'm switching out. <laughs> um, let's just let's just throw Dua out there. Oh, and we didn't lose our turn either. Let's see. Let's set up. Decently strong, really. Oh, it's water pulse. Good. Yikes. Not first. Oh, the crit. I think I would have survived that without the crit. Let's throw out Drifloon. Drifloon should be able to handle it, I think. It'll get one move, then we'll get two. Yeah, that should be... Oh, I thought we would get two. I guess not. Alright, let's just hit it with the normal. I don't think a strong would be quite enough, so... Uh, we should still be good. Wow, interesting. How the turn order works there. A little deceptive sometimes. But ultimately, doesn't really matter. Yeah, I definitely should, uh, next time, go back to town and get some better moves. Such prodigious strength. Now let me just heal up your Pokemon. Well now, I think that settles it. I must ask your help in retrieving the stolen wall fragment. With your skill, it should be a cinch. Yes, exactly. Some bandits pillaged the Salacion ruins and made off with a fragment of the wall engravings. Have you not heard of the notorious misfortunes? They're a trio of bandits that have even hit us Ginkgo, Ginkgo Guild merchants more than a few times. Not the kind of regulars I like to have, let me tell you. <laughs> Mistress Kalaba, Kalaba is doing everything she can to regain the fragment, but at 99 years old, it's a bit hard for her to chase leads all over the place. She's 99, wow. So what do you say, kind madam? Why not help find the fragment for the warden? Oh, naturally, I'll be happy to lend you a hand. How convenient. Those sisters swiped my wares too, and I'm no ginkgo guild merchant if I take that lying down. And far be it from me to let them just get away with vandalizing the precious ruins of this region. You know, I did see the remains of a campfire near the Myrland's camp. Perhaps worth checking out? All right. So we are going to stop here. So thank you all so much for watching. And next time we'll go hunt down some thieves. So.